Learn from God to enlighten your soul. This is your daily devotional reading. Our Father cares, March 19th. Schemes of Satan. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about, seeking whom he may devour. 1 Peter 5 verse 8 It is unsafe to trust to feelings or impressions. These are unreliable guides. God's law is the only correct standard of holiness. It is by this law that character is to be judged. If an inquirer after salvation were to ask, What must I do to inherit eternal life? The modern teachers of sanctification would answer, Only believe that Jesus saves you. But when Christ was asked this question, he said, What is written in the law? How readest thou? And when the questioner replied, Thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all thy heart and thy neighbor as thyself, Jesus said, Thou hast answered right. This do, and thou shalt live. No value is attached to a mere profession of faith in Christ. Only the love which is shown by works is counted genuine. Yet it is love alone which in the sight of heaven makes any act of value. The hidden selfishness of men stands revealed in the books of heaven. Sad is the record which angels bear to heaven. Intelligent beings, professed followers of Christ, are absorbed in the acquirement of worldly possessions or the enjoyment of earthly pleasures. Money, time, and strength are sacrificed for display and self-indulgence, but few are the moments devoted to prayer, to the searching of the scriptures, to humiliation of soul and confession of sin. Satan invents unnumbered schemes to occupy our minds that they may not dwell upon the work with which we ought to be best acquainted. The arch-deceiver hates the great truth that brings to view an atoning sacrifice and an all-powerful mediator. He knows that with him everything depends on his diverting minds from Jesus and his truth. Those who would share the benefits of the Savior's mediation should permit nothing to interfere with their duty to perfect holiness in the fear of God. Our Father cares, March 19th.